Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I will show you how to set up a virtual host in a XAMPP on a Windows. A virtual host allows you to create custom domain names for your local projects, making development easier. So let's get started. First step is open the XAMPP and start the Apache server. If Apache does not start, Make sure no other service is using port 80 or 443. Next, we need to configure the virtual host file. For that, go to your XAMPP installation folder and open the httpd-vhost.conf file. So, I will open my folder explorer and I have installed XAMPP inside the D drive. In your case, the drive may be different like C or D. After that, Go to the XAMPP folder, next go to the apache, con, extra and scroll down and you can see the httpd-vhost.con file. Open this file in notepad++ or the vs code. Now scroll down to the bottom and copy this existing code and paste it on a new line. First remove this hash from these lines and I will delete the first line server admin which is not required. These lines are not mandatory so I will delete this and remove these commented two lines. In the document root add the path of your project. So my project name is my site which is located inside the XAMPP stdocs and my hyphen site i will replace this dummy host to example.com with my project name my hyphen site and server name which you want to set so i want to open this site like my site dot local save this file this will be our custom domain now next step is we need to map our custom domain to the local host. For that we need to do changes in host file. That file is located inside the C drive. Go to the C drive. After that go to the windows folder. Then search for the system32. After that search for the drivers. Inside drivers go to etc folder and here you can find the host file. Open this file in notepad++ or the vs code and make sure your notepad++ or vs code is open as an administrator. In this file copy this line and paste it here and replace this local host with our custom domain name that is mysite.local mysite.local save the file and restart the apache and test the your virtual host so i will now restart the apache first i will stop it and again start it apache is started open the browser and type our custom domain name that is http colon slash slash my site dot local and here you can see we have successfully created the virtual host for our local website and that's it you have successfully created a virtual host in a XAMPP on a windows machine this make it easier to work on a multiple projects with the custom domain names if you found this video helpful give it a thumbs up subscribe to our channel and let me know in the comments if you have any queries see you in the next video